The selectively compliant, under-actuated hand developed by SRI International, Stanford University, and Mecca Robotics features four tendon-driven finger modules, each housing a separate force-sensing tendon drive. Two fingers are capable of reconfiguring into a variety of grasps by means of two independently controlled motors in the palm. Electrostatic brakes, located in the joints of each finger, are capable of independently locking, allowing the fingers to acquire a variety of locked shapes. In this example, joints are successively locked and unlocked, leaving one degree of freedom remaining in each finger to be fully controlled. Capacitive sensing is featured throughout the design, with tactile sensors located on the inner surfaces of the fingers and joint sensing located at each finger joint. Once calibrated, the joint angle sensors are capable of resolving roughly over 2200 counts per revolution. The tactile suite has 96 sensing sites and a 200 Hz sampling rate. Each site is capable of resolving normal forces from 20 millinewtons, about 2 grams, up to saturation at roughly 130 newtons. The difference between grasping a 30 and 35 pound weight, a difference of about 2.25 kilograms, can be seen in these two clips. Real life performance is often difficult to predict during the design phase because friction, nonlinear kinematics, and grasping strategy can play such an important role towards grasping ability. To characterize this interaction, several types of simulation were performed on objects of varying radius characterizing the relationship between object size, object position, actuator force, and the resulting contact forces imparted to the grasped object. Experiments were performed to verify grasping performance across a wide range of object sizes, pulling directions, and locking strategies. Force and trajectory data were logged, enabling comparisons with simulation. In real life, the performance of the hand can be demonstrated in the hand's ability to grasp a wide range of objects. In the following videos, a variety of grasping strategies were used, utilizing interlaced fingers to wrap around tools and pinch configurations to grasp smaller objects from the tabletop. The finger's ability to grasp large and small objects can be demonstrated in grasping irregular shapes such as a simulated rock, conical light bulb, and the handle of a briefcase.